you're looking at a globe or a map of the world And you want to understand it, you got to know these Hemispheres, North and South Pole, Equator, oceans, continents And lots and lots of countries The real world is round and shaped like a sphere and divided into east and west hemispheres The real world is round and shaped like a sphere and divided into east and west hemispheres On the top and the bottom where it's always cold are two points we call the North and South Poles. On the poles. top and the bottom where it's always cold are two points we call the North and South Poles. There's North and there's South. And in between the poles, you're right in the center, an imaginary line we call the equator. In between the poles, you're right in the center, an imaginary line we call the equator. If you're looking at a globe or a map of the world, And you want to understand it, you gotta know these Hemispheres, North and South Poles, Equator, Oceans, Continents, and lots and lots of countries The world is mostly water, I'll say it again, the world is mostly water filled with oceans Pacific Ocean, Atlantic Ocean, Arctic Ocean, Indian Ocean, Pacific Ocean, Atlantic Ocean, Arctic Ocean, Indian Ocean, and the Southern Ocean. But there is also land, so please don't forget it's divided into seven continents. North and South America, Europe and Africa, Asia, Australia, and Antarctica. the continents is divided again into many different countries also called nations how many countries have you ever wondered count them all up it's almost 200 almost 200 countries sing it one more time if you're looking at a globe or a map of the world